Hi, this is George from eAccess Solutions Tech Support. I just want to talk a little bit more about some of the, the uh, speed dial features that we talked about earlier. We mentioned in our previous video about shortcuts versus speed dial. The difference we pointed out was that pressing a letter that's assigned to a shortcut momentarily will invoke that shortcut like the letter M for messages. But if you were to hold the letter M, it will actually invoke a speed dial if you have that programmed. So we're going to talk a little bit more this time about how to create a speed dial. Basically, the trick on uh, assigning a speed dial, the simplest way to do it, is simply to hold that letter from the home screen. So we're, we're going to start on the home screen, and this time we're going to hold the letter G for George. And notice it's saying, assign a speed dial key to the letter G. So we're going to say yes by clicking on that. That takes you to your address book application. Then you can highlight the entry that you want to use. In this case, we'll say George. And I'm going to click on that. And notice it's built the speed dial list and it's added that entry to my speed dial list. Here's some other ones that we have on here already. So now if I simply want to dial that speed dial, all I do is simply hold that key and notice it goes right into my speed dial for George. I'm going to end the call here. So again, the difference is, is that a short press of a, of a key or of a like a function key like M for messages or L for calendar will invoke that application but a long press will invoke the speed dial. This was a short video showing how to dial speed dial entries or add speed dial entries on your BlackBerry. For more information please visit www.eaccess.com or www.wireless by eaccess.com.